In this video, we're going to talk about how to handle drop-down menus in Octoparse. Drop-down menus are a common graphical user interface element that allows users to choose from a list of options that appear when they click a button. Often, we need to interact with drop-down menus to scrape the target data. In Octoparse, setting up a step to go through all the drop-down options is straightforward. Simply click on the target drop-down menu then select Loop Through the Options in the drop-down menu. This will enable your task to cycle through each option. If you need to select a specific option from a drop-down, you'll need to update the X path. For instance, if we want Octoparse to select the third option only, click on the loop item, add 3 at the end of the X path, and click Apply. Now, when you click on Loop Item, you'll see that only the third option is selected. But what if we want to select all the options except the first one? You can achieve this easily with an XPath expression. Add position 1 at the end of the XPath. And click Apply. As you can see, all drop down options are selected except for the first one. To summarize, we covered how to loop through all options, select a specific option, and exclude the first option from the selection in a drop-down menu using Octoparse. Try these techniques in your own tasks and see how they can streamline your data scraping process. Thanks for watching! If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe for more tips and tricks. For further assistance, feel free to contact us at support at octoparse.com.